All right, guys. So I accidentally got off of work later than what I meant to. They asked me to stay an hour later and then I got confused with my original time and I stayed like probably like 45 minutes more. And so I need to clean up because I'm sticky. I smell like coffee, which is the worst thing. I'm not complaining about that part, but I'm sticky and I am sweaty. <laughs> I'm going to clean up and then eat. I have my food warming up and then I got to get going to the tattoo shop, guys. <laughs> why I'm not on my bike. I don't know. Aside from me getting a tattoo that I wanted, after exercising and going through the bit of pain that I did, I think I deserve a Sprite or something. I'm tired and hot. And I took cleaned up before I went out. Now I just feel icky again. Yeah. Alrighty guys, so I'm sitting back at home. I've been home for a while now. It's like almost 6 p.m. now. Um, I filmed my Ipsy video. I know you guys are excited for that. That video is going to be up before this one, so go check it out. Um, I've been at home for a while now that I finished doing my Ipsy video, and I got a few things from the corner store like my well-deserved Fanta drink that I decided on. I got my husband some True Moo which is in the fridge. I got um, some healing ointment that I'm going to be using um, for my tattoo and this is a fragrance free um, uh, lotion that I'm going to use afterward as well. And I can kind of show you what it looks like right here. This is like a new type stuff that uh, I've seen a lot of tattoo artists use on smaller tattoos like this. Um, that is just the ink that is being smushed around. This is going to protect my tattoo, my um, tattoo artist who did this flash, um, she is, she said that I could wear this until tomorrow, and then she recommended that I clean it four times a day with an antibacterial soap, and then, um, she gave me instructions, I have to read them, because they have, like, a nice little easy sheet to print out, um, I think she said that I can put this on, I wash it, four times a day with the antibacterial soap and then I can put a tiny bit of this 
on it um, to help it heal and I do that for like three days and then for the rest of the time up until it's done healing which is like a couple months I believe I need to be putting um, a, a, a fragrance free nice lotion on it to help it out and they were really nice inside the tattoo shop I feel like I'm really uncool I'm not cool enough for tattoos but they're cool and I like them and they were really nice and I felt really awkward but um you know because she asked me she was like oh is this your first tattoo and while I was getting it done she was like uh, you're doing a really good job and like you're doing really good for your first tattoo and I think I want to talk more about my experience with it aside from me just saying a little bit here I think I'm gonna do a separate video about my full experience with it but this was just I wanted to do a quick vlog of me going to get it done so that I really wanted a tattoo and of course, I had been looking at this for a bit, aside from me liking it, deciding on it. Um, I thought it was something that was cute, that I liked, that wasn't too crazy. You know what I'm saying? Something simple that I can enjoy, that I got. Tattoo Artist was really great. Yes, I just really liked my experience, and I like my tattoo, and I can't. Well, I can't wait. I hate the thing where people say I can't wait and I try really hard not to. I can't wait for this. Yes, I can wait. I want it to heal properly. Yes, I can't wait. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying. But, um, yeah, I keep showing you. This is it. It's going to be healing. Um, yeah, I'm just really excited. It's really cute. I like it. It's on my left side. I'm really excited. I don't know what else to say other than um, thanks for watching. And uh, if you could please stay tuned for my next video so you, can guys, you guys can get an update about what's happening. Um, yeah. Until next time, guys. Thanks. Bye.